Hi, I'm Chris Harper and with me is Michaela and we're here to demonstrate an application for IT band syndrome at the hip. This is when you experience pain on the outside portion of the hip. Some causes of this may be overuse, training on hills or stairs, muscle imbalances, overpronation of the foot, or gluteus medius weakness. This also happens to be the application for hip bursitis. KT tape helps with this condition by decreasing pressure to reduce pain and may increase circulation. For this application, we're going to place the hip in an abducted or sorry, adducted position, so shifting that hip out. And I'm just going to place an orange dot right over Michaela's hip just to indicate where your pain may be. Your pain may be vary slightly, but this you can use this uh, application for over the hip. Okay, we're going to take our first full strip. We're going to fold that in half, and we're going to cut rounded corners on the folded end of the tape. The rounded corners helps prevent the tape from getting caught on clothing. We're going to twist and tear the backing paper on this piece and peel that paper back, being very careful not to touch the adhesive of the tape. So handling the tape only with the paper. Okay, we're going to stretch evenly using our finger and thumbs, and we're going to place that with 80% stretch over that point of pain. We're going to peel off the paper, just laying the ends of the tape with absolutely zero stretch. Now, Michaela's taping over her shorts, but at home you're going to apply this directly to the skin. Okay, for our next piece, we're going to, again, tear the paper in the middle. And we're going to stretch that tape 80%. So, again, if you take that out on 100% and then back that off just a little bit, that's 80%. In the very ends of the tape, you're going to apply with absolutely zero stretch. That looks great. Okay, we're going to take an additional full strip of tape. And just like with the first piece, we're going to fold in half, cutting rounded corners on the folded end of the tape. Once again, this is to prevent any corners from getting caught on clothing. We're going to take twist, we're going to take twist and tear that backing paper. Peeling it back, being careful not to touch the adhesive of the tape, as this may affect the adhesive quality of the tape. We're going to apply this, again, with 80% stretch crossing over our first two pieces. We're going to peel the paper backing off on the ends with absolutely zero stretch. As we lay that down, give a little bit of a rub so it adheres well. And for our last remaining piece, again, just like the others, we're going to twist and tear that backing paper peeling that paper back, handling the paper only on the tape, and we're going to stretch that to 80%, nice and even, crossing over the other pieces and adhering those ends of the tape to the skin with absolutely zero stretch. Give that whole thing a good friction rub while still in a, the position of shifting that hip out. That friction creates a little heat, which allows that tape to adhere to the skin much stronger. Here are some helpful tips before applying. Clean the skin very well. Remove any lotions or skin oils that may be on your skin uh, so you have better, better adhesion. Also trim excessive hair, again, for the same reason, so you have nice adhesion to the skin. Uh, be careful with taking clothing on and off as this may roll the tape. Some complementary treatments include rest, ice, anti-inflammatory medications such as ibuprofen, foam rolling, light stretching, and massage. Please seek care if you have severe pain or swelling or difficulty walking. For more information, see our website at kttape.com.